Now that you have this second table created below the first table, what we're going to do is we're going to compare the um, each of these content areas against the total possible points and then turn them into a percentage. So we're going to do this manually using the equal sign and then the um, slash sign for divided in Excel. So I'm going to put an equal sign here where I want my answer to end up for a statewide average for nature of science. And then I'm going to choose that number above, hit my slash for divided, and then compare that to the total possible points above, and then hit enter. And what that will give me is a percentage of what the nature of science is the statewide average versus the total possible points. I'm going to do the same for county average. Select the cell, hit equal. Then I'm going to take the county averages here and hit the slash for divided by and go again to the total possible and hit enter. That's 65%. And now for the elementary school, equal score of 6 divided by a total possible of 10. Hit enter and I can see that they've got 60 percent. I'm going to do the same for earth, space science, physical science, and life science. So I'm going to start here with the equal sign and I'm going to pick the statewide average divided by the total possible of points and then here I'm going to pick the county average and divide that by the total number of points. And lastly, I'm going to take the elementary school that I chose and its score divided by the total number of points possible and hit enter. So once I've got all of those together, I'll do physical science and then life science, and then I have the percentages for each. If your scores don't show up as percentages, just highlight those cells, and you can just highlight all of them at once and go up to the top of Excel and hit the little percentage sign, and it will turn them into percentages for you. The next thing we'll do is graph it.